It's mine, Goaty's Goaty's birthday today. If you don't know, today he turns 74. <laughs> That's good for him. <laughs> you you look so goat. sexy! <laughs> and we're singing. You guys sure you don't want the boulder bar? No. Air Force says we can do it without it. Yeah, I figured. Oh, yeah. Yeah. We just, just got it here. You guys can't give up. Oh. You guys got a oh, rocket. We that was going to work. The, 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 the boulder bar showed up. Let's just wedge them in there. <laughs> oh, look at that. It's great. It's in a little bit. <laughs> We like to push rocks in the north. You're not happy. You should have had it over there. I can see your face. <laughs> I don't know. I haven't killed a sheep on it yet. Ask know? me the next time we kill something. It was better over there. Certifications for first, second, third place, and Meat Hog's Choice, and of course, the coveted, the jeweled bead. Number one, numero uno. Woo, number one, baby! The next batch. The brewer's name is Jaffenhaar. Number four. Four. Uh-huh. Brewer's name, Edgel. Uh, Blue Blood. It is a mellow mel, but it apparently has nothing in it, so I don't it's, know how that's possible. It's blueberries. Mommy. Mommy had to help. Mama boy. X-ray number six. It is a naked mead, which, as we all know, contains no adjunct. So he puts good. <laughs> the competition is over. Try to sober up a little, you. <laughs> we have a summer coming up. <laughs> ah! That's hours away. Okay, the what I meant to say was <laughs> there's a lot of mead to finish before summer. Number three. Number three. Number three. We're going to celebrate each other by singing the Swedish happy birthday song. Yes, may you live a thousand years more. Yamo de Liva. Yeah. Who's got the soundtrack? Tour life. DJ, spin that. Yamo de Liva. Yamo de Liva. Yamo de Liva is the hundra de or. Yaviska de Liva. Yaviska de Liva. Yamo de Liva. Yamo de Liva. Yamo de Liva. 
One piece of cake with a big giant finger hole in it for our brother Hergard. And I can't think of a better person to eat that holy piece of cake than the grand Godi. My Godi's Godi. Hawkins. <laughs> Please get it all. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. Yeah. Hey, yeah. Hawkins. I think we just got married. One, two. Come on. Three. Yeah. yeah. That's a good one. Two. two. Hear ye, hear ye! Gather around all you party people! It's time to figure out who amongst us is a brewer. We have a winner of Meat Hog's Choice. Has uh, such American classics as Smells Fruity, Sweetness Overpowers Alcohol, Mommy saved the day. An American <laughs> classic. Tell your mom to come pick you up. <laughs> Flower note. Taste of blueberries. Had to grab a refill. An epic. Thanks, mom. Thanks, mom. <laughs> All right. Whip. Is he here? Nope. No. No. Once again, in Meat Hog fashion, Mommy saves the day for the Meat Hog's choice. Angel Davidson with Blue Blood. In third place, our second loser. So let's talk about some American classics here. Taste of beeswax. Mmm. Oh, that's good. Light. Sweet. Great naked mead, best version of a simple thing. Very tasty. Did not taste honey. Really though, good. Ah! <laughs> In third place, our very own brewer with Odin's. Ah! Yeah! <laughs> Second place, getting closer and closer to the grand prize, to the bejeweled bee. Second place. Smells hints of berry, very tart, like your mom's, like sulfur. Remind me of when I used to chew batteries as a child. If that's not a winning recipe, I don't know what is. Dry and tart. Be better. Be better. <laughs> In second place, our second place brewmaster, which is not quite first, Hawk and Veneta. Yeah! That goldy <laughs> smile! <laughs> whoa, 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 we don't want to see that smile. In first place, and the winner so of the good. coveted Bejeweled Bee is whoever made this is a stud. <laughs> <laughs> My guess would be he wrote this because that's who he is. <laughs> I'm not drunk by this point. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> By the way, this is entry number eight in first place. If that doesn't tell you something, <laughs> we're, we're, nothing we're, we're, does. Yeah. <laughs> I can guess. I can guess who judged this card. He got a very high rating from this particular person, and he said, "They're nice." They're nice. <laughs> <laughs> very nice. Very nice. Apple pie, apple to die for. Yeah. The winner yeah. of the second <laughs> annual Bee Jeweled Bee Riff. Monroe. Never oh! Does that guy is. Does the Air Force not get awards? We do say take okay. salute. <laughs> hey, I know your reign is over. Your reign of terror is over. You are no more. You are gone. All hail the new brewer. Father, hail Father, oh Father, oh. About three years ago, um, Scoggle and I. We had a little bay over there in the corner. It was kind of the family bay, and we used it, you know, a couple times a year. Maybe. We've had some rough times. We've had some hurdles. We've had some bad conflicts. We've had some bad blood. Um, but the, the people that are here, and of course Stig as well, um, we went through it all together. Mm -hmm. And three years isn't insignificant. 
three years is important. So if you look at any like business model, within three years, most businesses will fail, new businesses. In three years, 90% of restaurants, new restaurants fail. If you pass that, that marker, you've made it into something that can last 100 years or more. The last toast goes to the whites, the land vetter, the land spirits, the Disa, and all those supernatural creatures that inhabit our space. Hail the whites.